Have you ever imagined yourself having a superpower? Be invisible, having a supervision, my reading, you name it. It is unique, right? The next superhero. Well, I'm not a big fan of Marvel, but I do believe that everyone has his or her superpower. And it is our unique strength to gain success in our life and career. Today, I want to tell you a story about how I found my superpower through watching movies. My love for movies started when I avoided study during weekends in high school. I used to spend the whole day binging or watching movies for 20 hours, only watching Tom Cruise chasing bad guys again and again and trying to gain the confidence of facing my finals without reviewing any subject materials. Am I getting a good grade? Of course not. After all, I was not born a genius. But I did gain the sharp taste of movies through all these practices. After I went to my university, the first thing I did was looking for a movie club. There was none, so I built one. I can still remember I played a movie three billboards outside on the first movie night. I watched people's faces right after the lights were turned on. There was an air of satisfaction on them. And I thought to myself, wow, I do have a good taste in movies and I can make people happy. This might be my superpower. Meanwhile, my friends started to come and ask me for recommendations. It can easily go wrong when you pick movies for others, and a lousy suggestion could potentially ruin their plan for entertainment. Once, twice, third time, people kept coming back and telling me, Eileen, you are so good at recommending movies. And I thought to myself, hey, did I just beat Netflix? By sharing movies with others, was like the spider that bite Peter Parker and make him Spider-Man. It made me realize my superpower. Believe it or not, my friend called me Wonder Woman because I can just find a perfect movie for everyone and save them from watching a disappointing film. I was wondering how I did it and I came up with a summary. I call it OKK. Observation, kindness, and knowledge. You know, people see things all the time, but they don't always observe. Websites put tags on each movies and match people according to those tags. But from my observation, when people enjoy a movie, it is not only about the movie genre, it can be anything. So after each movie night, I talk to my audience, listen to them, and observe what they talk about and how they think about the movie. There are a thousand timelines for a thousand readers. I sense what people like, why they want them, and what they need. I was able to refine my matching to people's taste. The second secret is kindness. Being kind and willing to help others is what motivates me. Imagine Peter Parker become a thief after he got his power, or Iron Man is just a tech nerd who collects cool makers in series. No chance a good story will happen after that, right? During the pandemic, my friend, let's call her Heidi. Heidi was anxious and worried one day. She was concerned about the approaching graduation and her future. It is time to use my superpower, I thought to myself. So I found the perfect movie for her and I took her to see the movie. It was a story about finding love and passion for a soul before he jumped into a new one's body. At the end of the movie, I could see the relief on her face. She held my hand with gratitude and I could feel that she was ready for everything. The intention to love people and to do good was the key that turned my ability into a superpower.
If I were just a high school girl who escaped reality to movies, I would have never built a movie club. I would have never met so many friends and brought so much joy to this community. And I would never become a Wonder Woman. The last part of OKK is knowledge. Having a broad knowledge to your field is the fundamental of having a superpower. A sharpshooter is definitely not someone who don't know how to hold a gun. Without watching over 700 movies in the last five years, I would have never advised so many people. And this is gonna be the easiest step for you to start changing your superpower. If you like reading, writing, making robots, don't give it up. Keep on doing what you love, and that is going to become your superpower. All of us was born with a gift, a superpower. And believe me, your life will become much more meaningful and wonderful after you find yours. No need to get bite by a spider. All we need is to practice OKK in our daily life. Try to observe the world and be kind to people. Your superpower is right around the corner. Thank you.